rolling out a new initiative to help retain law enforcement and school resource officers in the state to the tune of $800 each. The retention bonus, part of an $84 million investment in law enforcement, which Governor Lee announced last year. State Capitol reporter Tori Gesner explains the potential impact that extra cash could have. Down the halls and past the classrooms, inside and out. Corporal Joshua Liberty provides protection for students and staff every day in Dixon County as a school resource officer. Once I became an SRO, I knew that was uh, it was the only the only job for me. But his duties go beyond the badge. I think being able to be here, just smile at them, give hugs, high five them, talk to them. Uh, I think it gives them a, a positive outlook on on their life. Like, hey, somebody cares about me or somebody loves me. And then they also get that positive outlook on law enforcement. Building a bridge between police and Tennessee's youth, Dixon County has an SRO inside every school in the district, providing invaluable services for students and staff. You can't put a price tag on their presence, but an extra $800 from the state doesn't hurt. Me-wise, I'm like, I love the babies. I'll do this for less money than I would make anyways. But um, I think the, the incentive of putting that out there will help other places recruit and keep the SROs. According to the state's numbers released this past May, around 500 Tennessee schools still didn't have an SRO, despite the General Assembly budgeting $140 million to pay for the positions last summer. The $800 retention bonuses are part of an $84 million investment made by the state to help recruit, retain, and train law enforcement, announced last year. The extra 800 will will be a big help, especially when around the time we're supposed to get it is in October. So, I mean, Christmas is right around the corner. While the saying goes, money talks, for Corporal Liberty, the students are the biggest perk of the job. It makes me a better person just being with them and making them happy. Reporting in Nashville, I'm Tori Gessner. Law enforcement officers who completed their 2023 in service training and SROs who completed their 2023-2024 academic school year will be eligible for this bonus. $60 million of the $84 million allocated for law enforcement last year will fund the bonuses and other recruitment efforts. The remaining dollars help the agencies pay for training.